I'm currently a professor in the Department of Medicine and at the University of Hong Kong. Um, I have researching for more than 15 or 20 years, and I find research exciting and fascinating, particularly when the research can change the practice um, and also improve patient's outcome. Um, this uh, research project is actually looking at the age of H. pylori eradication therapy and the subsequent risk of developing gastric cancers. So we look at the population cohort of a huge patients, uh, 63,000 individuals who have received H. pylori eradication therapy, um, stratify them according to the age group and see the subsequent risk of cancer development when compared to general population. And despite usual believe that H. pylori eradication should be given very early on before they develop pineoplastic lesions, our result found that even when you receive HPLA eradication beyond the age of 60, the risk of gastric cancer development was still significantly reduced. So suggesting that there's never too late to eradicate H. pylori, although it may be better to do it earlier, but even if you receive it at the age of 60, you can still prevent gastric cancer development. I think this is a very important question because the majority of patients who develop gastric cancers are elderly patients. And these patients are also at risk of developing H. pylori infections. So um, there are a large proportion of patients out there who have never received H. pylori eradication therapy. And there's always a concern whether it's actually too early or too late to eradicate H. pylori. So our results will help to answer that question that even if you receive H. pylori eradication very late, you can probably still reduce a substantial proportion of patients developing cancers. Well, um, I think it is a very exciting area. The results uh, with this cohort, we can still look at other possible risk factors and protective factors of different gastric cancers, particularly in individuals after H. pylori eradication therapy. Because so far, there's no other uh, preventive strategies to prevent cancer, gastric cancer apart from H. pylori eradications. <laughs>